Hi, Vanessa here. Welcome to another episode of Funneling Math with me. Typical question, double if. Let's take a look. Kristen and Shannon receive a sum of money each. If Shannon spent 10% of her money, she would have $6 less than Kristen. If Kristen spent 10% of her money, she would still have $1.60 more than Shannon. What was the total amount of money that both girls received? So in this case, as you can see, the two if are rather independent events that separate from each other. So in this case, um, how do we go about solving it? So remember in this kind of question, the two if's are actually the first if is to tell us how Kristen and um, Shannon's amount of money are related. And the other is actually for us to solve the units. Let's take a look as we work through this example. So the first if, if Shannon spent 10% of her money, she would have $6 less than Kristen. So in order to do away with the percentage, because um, so that we don't be so bothered with the base, so let's use units instead. So if let's say, is, um, Shannon had 100 units. So after spending 10% of money, she would have 90% left. So 90% of her money would be 90 units. So after scenario one, Kristen would have $6 more than Shannon. So it would be 90 units plus $6. So remember, this two is after scenario one. So what is the original? So in this case, it's pretty easy because original would be 100 units for Shannon. And then nothing has changed for Kristen. So Kristen would be 90 units plus $6. So as far as I said just now, these two right now are how they are related. Um, the amount of money, Shannon, 100 units, Kristen will be 90 units plus $6. Then the other scenario, it's actually for us to solve the units since right now we have established the relationship between how the amount of money is related so let's do as the question says if Kristen spent 10% of her money she will still have $1.60 more than Shannon so in this case you realize that um, Kristen is actually made out of two different parts so one is uh, the darker blue which is 90 units and the other is the lighter blue of $6 so in order to work out um, the remaining the remaining 90% we have to do both both portions okay Shannon nothing has happened in scenario 2 so it will be the same for Kristen what is 90% of 90 units we can work out to be 90 out of 100 times 90 units which is 81 units likewise what is 90% for six dollars okay working out we have an answer as Five dollar and forty cent. So after scenario two, this is the amount of money that Kristen had. And then what were we told? We were told that she would have one dollar and sixty cent more than Shannon. So this is one dollar and sixty cent. So if you were to take away that portion, I think the solution is pretty obvious right now. You can see that this difference here in terms of units will be one hundred minus 81 units and in terms of value is actually five dollars and forty cent minus one dollar and sixty cent so right now we can solve our units which is um 19 units equals to three dollars and eighty cent uh, one unit to any cent and what do we have the total amount of money that both girls had so original 100 units plus 90 units and then plus six dollars since we have found the units, we know uh, we will got the sum to be $44. And that's your answer. So remember in this kind of um, double if questions, the first if is actually to tell you how the amount of money between Kristen and Shannon is related. And the other if is actually for us to solve the units. Okay, that's it. Oh, the end of the question. Simple as it sounds. Um, so give me a like if you find it beneficial. You could even um, subscribe to my channel for more videos and actually you can go back to take a look at all my um, previous videos that I have already uploaded. 
hope it's um hopefully I'll be beneficial to you. Have a nice day. Goodbye.